When you're designing a, a robot arm, 90% of your time is spent on both the gripper and the base. Our bases have always had bearings around them, and you had to do that because these types of hobby servos are very weak with the horns. They're very easy to break. So we tried lots of different methodologies trying to figure out what to do about that and found that just large, flat slewing bearings was the way to go. And when you're doing low cost like hobby arms, you can have cheaper bearings that aren't as strong. And we discovered that these Lazy Susan bearings do the job really well. For our low cost arms, we put those inside. Uh, it keeps the profile nice and low, keeps costs down, and they're easy to work with. The bigger arms have RU66 bearings in them. These are industrial bearings and they are hilariously overkill for this. These are designed for industrial machines. They're extremely heavy and they can handle thousands of pounds. So it's kind of hilarious that we use them in a hobby arm that's a thousand dollars. Trust in Robotics, helping innovators innovate.